Hello and welcome to JJK Yoga. We're going to spend the next 15 minutes doing a whole body stretch. So come to lie flat on your back, have your knees bent, feet on the mat. Take an inhale, as you exhale, slowly draw your right knee into your chest. Inhale, as you exhale, draw that knee towards your right armpit. On your next inhale, extend that right leg up to the ceiling, wrap your hands around the right thigh. Keep that foot flexed. Keep drawing that heel away and just breathe into the back of that right leg. If you have a, if you have a tight hamstring, just have a bend in the knee. Take an inhale as you exhale, bend that knee, place the outside of that foot onto that left thigh and just use your right hand to draw that right leg away. If you want to go a little bit further, raise the left foot off the mat, wrap your hands around your left thigh, draw that left thigh in towards you and then use your right arm to draw your right leg away. Now slowly lower the left foot onto the mat, grab the back of the right heel, maybe your index and middle finger around your big toe or the outside of the foot. So you come into a single legged happy baby pose. And then just gently open your right hip here. So you can just do a gentle rock from side to side. And then slowly place that right foot onto the mat. Draw the left knee into the chest. Take an inhale as you exhale. Slowly draw that knee towards your left armpit. On your next inhale, extend that left leg up to the ceiling, foot flex, wrap your hands around your left thigh. And then just breathe into the back of that leg. Take an inhale as you exhale, just bend that knee, place the outside of that foot onto the right thigh. Use your left hand just to draw that left leg away. If you want to go a little bit further, reach your right foot off the mat, wrap your hands around your right thigh. And as you draw that right leg in towards you, use your left arm to draw that left leg away. Keep the left foot flexed. Slowly lower the right foot back down to the mat. And we're going to come to a single leg happy baby pose. So you're either going to grab the back of that left heel, maybe the index and middle finger, finger around the big toe, or just the outside of the foot. You want the sole of the foot Parallel to the ceiling, knee joined down to the mat. And again, you can just do a gentle rock here, just opening up that left hip. And then slowly bringing that foot down to the mat, roll over to one side and come to a seated position. So we're going to come to a cross-legged seated position, right leg in front. Ideally, you want to walk the opposite foot under the opposite, uh, you want to walk the right foot under the left knee and the left foot under the right knee. If your knees are really high, you can come to sit on a block or a cushion. Place your palms over your knees, draw your shoulders down your back, take an inhale. As you exhale, slowly lower your chin down to your chest. And then slowly roll your right ear to your right shoulder. Chin back to chest, left ear to your left shoulder. Chin back to chest. Let's do that one more time. Right ear to right shoulder. Chin to chest. Left ear to left shoulder. Chin to chest. Raise your head. Now bring your left hand outside your right knee and walk your right hand back. Gaze towards me. Take an inhale. And as you exhale, slowly twist over to the right. Slowly come back to centre. Bring your right hand outside your left knee. Bring your left hand be behind. Gaze towards me. Take an inhale. And as you exhale, slowly twist over to the left. And then inhale back to centre. Now we're going to slowly walk our hands forward as we draw our chest down towards the mat. And then slowly come back up. Turn your torso over your right knee, take an inhale, and as you exhale, start to walk your hands forward again, drawing your chest over your right knee. Keep drawing your left sit bone down. And then slowly come back up. Switch legs, now bring your left leg in front. And this time bring your hands to your shoulders, and we're just going to do some forward rolls, drawing small circles with our elbow, elbows. 
and then just slowly increase the side leg circles and now let's reverse it so small circles to begin with and then start to enlarge in the circles as you draw your shoulders back and then slowly bring your right arm by your ear bend your elbow bring your hand in between your shoulder blades bring your left arm behind you bend the elbow and try to bring your hands to touch if they don't touch just grab your top now draw that right bicep by your ear, draw the left shoulder back. And then slowly release your hands. This time bring your left arm by your ear, bend the elbow, draw the hand by the shoulder blade, and then bend the right elbow. Bring the right hand to meet the left hand if you can, otherwise you just grab your top. Then slowly rotate that left bicep to face your ear, and draw that right shoulder back. And then slowly release your arms. Now again, walk your hands forward, drawing your chest down towards the mat. Then slowly come back, turn your torso over your left knee this time, take an inhale. As you exhale, walk your hands forward, drawing your chest over your left knee, really reaching that right hip back. And then slowly come back up. Let's come to a tabletop position. Wrists underneath your shoulders, knees underneath your hips, toes pointing back. And then as we inhale, you're going to draw your tailbone back, chest forward, gaze forward. Exhale, round your spine up towards the ceiling. Inhale, chest forward, tailbone back. Imagine your shoulders are drawing down towards your knees. Exhale, really round through the spine, navel up towards the ceiling, chin to chest. One more, inhale, chest forward, tailbone back. Exhale, round the spine up towards the ceiling. Now from here, come to a neutral spine. As you inhale, bring your right arm out to the side. And as you exhale, thread that arm underneath your left armpit. Come into the top of that right shoulder. And then just walk your left hand to the top of your mat. So you're breathing underneath that right shoulder, extending the left side. Now slowly walk that left hand back, press down into the left hand to come back to tabletop. As you inhale, reach your left arm out to the side. As you exhale, thread it underneath your right armpit, bring your left cheek down. Extend your right arm to the top of the mat. So breathe, really breathing into the under part of that left shoulder, extending the right side. And then slowly walk your right hand back, press down into the hand. Come to tabletop and then step your right foot in between your hands. Walk that left leg further back. Make sure that right knee is tucked above that right heel. So you can inhale. As you exhale, slowly draw your hips back, extend your front leg. You can lift your toes and draw your torso onto the inside of that leg. Inhale, come forwards. Exhale back. Inhale forwards, bring your hands onto the inside of your right leg, draw that right knee into your, into your right arm. You can stay there, we can come down to your elbows. If you have blocks, you can place the blocks underneath your forearms. Gaze is forward. And then slowly come back up. From here, you're going to walk your right foot over to the left and make your way to a pigeon pose. So really tuck that left hip under. Start by walking your hands inside of your hips. Inhale, lengthen the spine. As you exhale, slowly start to bring your torso over your front leg. Extending your arms forward. So you're really drawing that left hip under, right hip back. If your forehead doesn't meet the floor, you can use a block or a cushion underneath. If your right hip is really high, you can always place a block under your right hip. Take one more breath here. And then slowly walk your hands back. Extend your spine as you inhale. And then slowly make your way back to tabletop. Now step your left foot in between your hands. Again, make sure your knee is stacked above your heel. You can draw that right leg back. Take an inhale. As you exhale, slowly draw your hips back. Extend your front leg. Draw your torso onto the inside of that left leg. Inhale forwards. Exhale back. 
And then slowly come forwards, bring your hands onto the inside of your left leg, again drawing your left knee into your left arm, or you can come down to your elbows. Again, if you used blocks last time, you can use blocks again. Keep drawing your left knee into your left arm. Then slowly come back up, walk that left foot over to the right, really extend that right leg back, tuck that right hip under, hands to hips, inhale, lengthen, as you exhale you're going to draw your torso over your front leg, extending your arms forward, so again tuck that right hip under, left hip back, forehead doesn't meet the mat, you can just place a block underneath, if your left hip is really high, again you can just place a block underneath the hip. Find the last inhale, leg and exhale, and then slowly as you inhale, start to walk up, extend your spine, come back to tabletop, come to kneeling, and then bring your legs out in front. Pull the flesh from underneath your sit bones, and have a nice long back. Then bend your right knee, and place the sole of your right foot onto the inside of the left leg. Turn your torso over your left leg, keep that left leg active, keep, uh, active, keep the left foot flexed, heel pressing down into the mat, toes pointing up. Take an inhale as you exhale, walk your hands either side of that leg, drawing your chest over that left leg. Try not to grab the foot here. If you have a tight hamstring, you can just have a bend in that left knee. And then slowly walk your way back up. Bring that right knee back to centre, extend that leg. Again, pull the flesh out from underneath your sit bones, bend your left knee, and place the sole of the foot onto the inside of the right leg. And let that knee come out to the side. Turn your torso over your right leg, take an inhale. And then as you exhale, slowly walk your chest over that leg. Again, keep that leg active, foot nice and flexed. And then slowly come back up. Bring the left foot on the mat, extend the leg, and then bring the soles of your feet to meet. You can either have your heels drawn in or heels slightly out, hands around your feet or your ankles. Sit your sit bones back, take an inhale, try to draw the shoulders down your back, and as you exhale, just draw your chest down towards your feet. Again, use your elbows against your, the inside of your legs to draw your knees down. And then slowly come back up. From here we're going to come to tabletop again. And from tabletop we're going to come to a downward dog position. Just slowly walk your feet in halfway. Now turn your toes out, heels in, and come to a quick squat position. Just bring your hands to heart centre. Again, using your arms on the inside of your legs just to draw your legs out. Try to draw those hips down. And then slowly place the hands on the mat. Bring yourself to standing forward fold. Just hang here, let your head hang heavy. Bend your knees if you need to. And then slowly press down into your heels as you inhale and roll up to standing. Now we're going to place our left hand on our hip and just draw our right heel back, grabbing the outside of that foot and just drawing that knee back as we stretch the front of that right quad. And then slowly lower that leg. Bring your right hand to your right hip, draw your left foot back, grab the outside of that foot and just draw that knee back, just stretching the left quad. You can always use a wall if you find it difficult to balance here. And then slowly place that foot down, 
gaze toward, towards me. Bring the insides of your feet, your knees and thighs to touch. And then we reach your arms up and over your head. Grab the back of your right wrist. Really draw your right fingertips to the ceiling. Right inhale down to the mat. Take an inhale. As you exhale, draw that hand over to your left hips, over to the right. And then hand back to centre. Grab the back of your left wrist. Reach the left fingertips up to the ceiling. Left heel down. Take an inhale. As you exhale, hand over to the right, hips over to the left. And then come back to centre. Hands through prayer. Do you inhale, reach your arms up and over your head. And then bring your hands down to heart centre. Close your eyes here. Draw your shoulders down your back. And then just draw your forehead down to your fingertips. Namaste.